YouTube, TikTok, Instagram. There are a lot of social media platforms, and that brings me to the question, which one is the best? So to put it lightly, we need to watch videos that represent every platform to truly test which one is the best. But how do we find such videos, you may ask? Well, what better videos than each platform's most viewed videos? I mean, if you think about it, each platform's algorithm somehow pushed these videos to the most amount of people, so it really should be the best the platform has to offer. So let's find out which one is the best. So we have five tiers of content right here with the top being S tier content. So this is genuinely really entertaining content. Next up, we have would watch willingly. So this is something that like if you put on, I would watch it and probably be interested. Next up, we have fun watch, I guess, which means it was all right. Like it wasn't too entertaining, but I mean, if you put it on, I wouldn't complain. Next up, we have not good. This is content that I genuinely would not want to watch. I'd probably turn it off. And finally, we have couldn't pay me to watch. So just as it says, you could not pay me to watch this content. Now, what better platform to start us off than YouTube, the one you're using right now. So the most viewed video on YouTube is Baby Shark. It has 15.3 billion views, which is insane. That's twice as many people as there are in the world. Now, technically, I can't play this video for you because it's actually going to get copyright strike so i actually have to mute it but a lot of y'all have probably heard baby shark we can take a look at it right now so yeah baby shark it is a classic video I don't even know why Baby Shark is the most popular video. It's kind of a trend I noticed amongst YouTube. I was looking for the most viewed videos and a lot of them were kids content or music videos. And this happens to be a kids content geared music video. So it makes sense. It has the most two viewed categories into one video. But yeah, this has 15.3 billion views. It technically is the most viewed video on the internet. It's going to have more views than anything we're watching on any other platform in this entire video. I thought it would be lame if we just use Baby Shark as a representation of what YouTube is. So I actually got the most viewed videos that are not music videos or not kids content. So the most viewed piece of content on YouTube that isn't a kids video or a music video is actually a YouTube short by Mr. Beast called Giving iPhones Instead of Candy on Halloween. This video has 1.3 billion views. So let's check it out. Hey, you want an iPhone? Yes, yes, please. Thank you. Yo, I Dude, love why the can't costume. that be me? Here's an iPhone. Thank you. Oh my gosh. You get two for having a Minecraft costume. What? Oh my god. I literally need a new phone. Like, Mr. Beast, please give me a new phone. Phones. Happy Halloween. Hey, here's $10,000. Damn, is that a power? No, no, it's yours. What is no, that? Oh, he's it. trying to give it back. What a go. Hey, here's an okay. iPhone. Okay. Here's an iPhone. You want one as well? Here Dude, you these go. kids Happy are too young Halloween. to be getting iPhones anyway. These kids are like 10 years old. Here, take them. Here's an iPhone. Yo, the baby Yoda. Oh, yes, please. Okay, here's an iPhone. Oh, there's two of you. One second. There we go. Yo. How many iPhones do you think this guy? Do you think he just has like a closet full of iPhones in his closet? Do you want a PlayStation? Yeah. You want two AirPods? Yo, that's so hey. high. Who's that over there? You want an iPhone? What? I want a candy. I've got a jar <laughs> of peanut butter. I'm allergic. Damn, that's tough. Now, that was a pretty entertaining short. It makes a lot of sense, like, seeing all the reactions. And it's just Mr. Beast, so it's going to get a lot of views. Now, I did want to get the most viewed video that isn't a YouTube short, and that's this one right here. So, the most viewed non-YouTube short video is actually called How Zach King Gets Away With Doing Graffiti. It's not actually Zach King. It's this account called Dollar Bill, but it has 1.2 billion views, 1.236 to be exact. Um, but, yeah, it's kind of a short. It's not exactly a vertical piece of content, so it's not counted as a short. But, yeah, this is the video. So we have Zach King painting this 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 ladder, it looks like, on the wall. I think I've seen this video. But if you know Zach King, he's all into, like, optical illusions and video editing. So I think, yeah, he climbs up the ladder here that he just painted. Uh, and this is, I think, uh, the, the artwork itself is, like, a Banksy art, which is uh, a really famous graffiti artist. Ooh. And then, yeah, he climbs up this. And then this guy's like, what the heck? Yeah, I've seen this video. I think most of y'all have seen this video. I mean, it is the, technically the most viewed video on, the, on YouTube, so... So in a way, it is a YouTube short, but I would say that the content is actually pretty entertaining there. So for YouTube, I'd probably put them in the would watch willingly tier. I mean, Baby Shark, I probably wouldn't watch, but I mean, that's a piece of kids content, so I don't really count it. The Mr. Beast short was a really entertaining short, and the Zach King video is also really entertaining, so I'd probably put it in would watch willingly. Next up here, we have TikTok, and the most viewed TikTok is also by Zach King. This guy just owns social media. He is in the top five most viewed videos on almost every single platform. Something about this dude, it just causes virality. It's crazy. So the most viewed video right here is this one right here. It's called Zach's Magic Ride, and it has 2.3 billion views. The video itself has 2.5 million likes, 1.2 million saves, and 690k comments. So that's insane. Let's check it out. Okay. So he's just riding his magic broom, I guess. I think this is a Harry Potter. Like my costume? Yo, that's so cool. Oh, and it's How like a mirror. What the? A Nimbus 2000. How did he do that? Oh, oh and it's, Wait, he's on a skateboard. Longboard? Longboardium Leviosa! Zach, <laughs> 
absolutely insane. I have no idea how he does half of his videos. Um, I think a lot of it's editing, but also it has some practical effects to it. But yeah, another Zach King video, obviously mind blowing again. Did I honestly think he was any better than the piece of content on YouTube? Probably not. I think the reason this was popular on TikTok and not on YouTube is because the fact that it's shorter, it's only 18 seconds long and obviously TikTok users have a shorter attention span. But yeah, this is crazy, it's 2.3 billion views. Now the second most viewed video that we have on TikTok actually isn't Zach King, it's actually James Charles. It's this video right here that has 1.7 billion views. Let's check it out. So the video is called Welcome to the Sisters Christmas Party and it has 9.4 million likes, 111,000 comments. So uh, a decent chunk amount less than Zach King's video, but this is the second most viewed video on TikTok. So it looks like an FPS, kind of like Call of Duty here. What am I watching? Yeah, I have no idea why that's the second most viewed video on TikTok. And it honestly makes me question TikTok itself. I feel like that wasn't a crazy piece of content or anything. And it's not like James Charles was thirst trapping insanely hard. Let's look at some of the comments here. Comments November 14th. Anyone just came back to see this video? Like people are coming back to see this video. Like what's so special about this video? Is there something I'm not understanding? What is going on? Like look at all these November 23rd, October 22nd, October 20th. What is going on? Honestly, I think I have to put the TikTok in the not good section. I mean, don't get me wrong. The Zach King video was great. Actually, should I put it in a fun watch? I don't know. I feel like those videos were polar opposite because you could not pay me to watch that James Charles video. But I mean, honestly, the Zach King one, I guess it was a fun watch. I'll put it right in the middle at not good here. Yeah, I don't know. That was crazy. Now, next up here, we have Instagram. And I think Instagram is interesting because the most followed person on Instagram is actually Cristiano Ronaldo. Yeah, Cristiano Ronaldo has 644 million followers, which is crazy because the most viewed video on YouTube actually doesn't even have 644 million views. He has 172 million views on his new video with Mr. Beast, actually. That, that might break the record soon. But the most viewed video I could find with research on the internet was by this guy named Rizwan Freestyle. He has 1.3 million followers. So actually not that many for having the most most viewed video. It's this video right here with 554 million views and it's also about soccer. So it might go to a lot to say how popular soccer is in the world, but let's check it out. So the caption is, has anyone seen the ball? And then it just has like some regular Instagram hashtags, hashtag reels, Instagram hashtag reels video. It's actually interesting to me that Instagram only has 550-ish million views for their most viewed video because other platforms have around like one to two billion views for their most viewed video. But I guess it makes sense since Instagram didn't always have videos. It was more of a photo centric website. And it also makes sense because you can't really search for videos on Instagram. Like they only pop up in your feed. So videos can only get so many views. So let's check this one out. Okay, so he kicks the ball. It bounces off the two stones, goes into the waterfall. That guy looks back. Is that it? That's that whole video? That was the whole video, dude. Why can't I get 550 million views? I feel like, I mean, okay, not gonna lie. I mean, obviously he's a good soccer player, but for that to be the most viewed video, I feel like sometimes I really thought that the most viewed videos were going to kind of encompass the social media platform as a whole, but I don't know. It feels like the most random videos get popular. Like, what the hell was that James Charles video? And this video, I mean, it's better than the James Charles video, but it just feels so random. And it looks like there's still people consistently commenting like four hours ago, eight hours ago. Like so many people are commenting every day, so it's only going to get more views. So I'm not going to lie. It is actually pretty difficult to find the most viewed videos on Instagram. So I had to go off this site because you can't just search for popular videos on Instagram, unfortunately. It says the number two one is a Samsung ad by BTS J-Hope, so I looked that up. I think this is the video. It's hard to say whether it's the exact one. I looked through Samsung's entire page, like on their Instagram reels to see if I could find this one. I can't find it. They have a lot of posts, so maybe I just couldn't find it. I did scroll through everything, but um, according to this website, this video has 319 million views. It only has 1 million likes, so it makes me skeptical whether or not this is the actual video, but I mean, it makes sense that it has a low like to view ratio because it's an advertisement, but let's find out here. Let's just watch this video. So it looks like it's just okay. Why does this look so photoshopped? Like this doesn't look like a good picture. It looks like he's cut out from like a green screen or something. Is that just me? Yeah, all those photos look like they were photoshopped or something. What the heck? Can you send me that? Okay. Okay, I don't know. I, I don't know why that's the most viewed. I mean, maybe they paid a lot for that ad to get to a lot of places. So I don't know. Ads are kind of hard to say whether they count as most viewed videos because obviously they paid for the views. So I guess that doesn't really count. So who is that? Was that Jungkook? No, J-Hope. Is that racist? I just don't, I don't know BTS like that, man. Yeah, for Instagram, I'm gonna have to go with not good again. I mean, I don't even know. I feel like, I mean, the soccer one was cool, but I, I definitely would not have fun watching that. Yeah, I mean, you could pay me to watch those, but... 
Yeah, not good content. Next up, we have Facebook. And I only got one video for Facebook. And that's because this video has 910 million views. That's like 300 million more than the second most viewed video on Facebook. This video is also 4 minutes and 33 seconds long, which is kind of longer than the typical video we've been watching today. So I just decided to choose one for this platform. This video is called Illusionist Rihanna on Asia's Got Talent 2017. So it looks like it's just an Asia's Got Talent clip. Is they going to be speaking English or are they going to be speaking in some kind of East Asian language? Let's find out. Hi. Oh, okay. Oh God. She's tweaking. Oh. So she's gonna take a picture, I guess. Oh, what the hell? I what the? Really. I mean. Wow. So the video wasn't bad or anything, but I don't think it was the craziest Got Talent video I've ever seen or anything. It's interesting that these videos really become the most viral videos on their platform because I feel like they're nothing special. Am I tripping? So for Facebook here, I guess I'd put it in the fun watch, I guess. I mean, definitely I had more entertaining time watching that than a lot of the other videos. But yeah, it wasn't anything crazy. I definitely would not willingly watch that. So I guess I'll put it in the fun watch, I guess. Now, next up, we have Twitch. Now, Twitch isn't a video platform like the other ones we watch today where people post videos, people just live stream, but you can actually clip videos from their live streams, and those can become pretty viral. So, the most viewed clip is by Stable Ronaldo, um, and he has 17.553 million views on this clip called Nah. Let's check it out. Okay, was that him? I don't really know Valorant, so this is him playing. Yeah, say sorry, dude. Okay, he's talking trash. Say so oh, man. <laughs> Is it just a oh, voice no, crack? No, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, hell no. Is it just a voice crack? Is that all oh, the clip is? Hell no. Damn. Okay, so this guy, Stable Ronaldo, I've never heard of this guy. I mean, he has 3.6 million followers. I think that's a lot for Twitch. So, yeah, Stable Ronaldo with a voice crack has the most viewed video on Twitch with just a voice crack. Can I get 17.5 million views for a voice crack? Please? Yeah, for Twitch, I'm gonna I'm gonna put in the not good. So this is the final tier list. We didn't have any S tier content. We only had one would watch willingly, and most of the content was not good. We didn't have any ones that you couldn't pay me to watch, so that's a good sign of these platforms. So the point of this video was to find out which platform was the best. So technically here, it would be YouTube, but it's hard to say because these videos felt really random, and I didn't feel that they encapsulated their entire platform as a whole. Anyway, I love doing these experiences. So if you want to watch more, please subscribe and leave a like on this video. Thank you so much. I love every single one of you. Peace.